Our All Indiana artist founded and fronted the rock band Healing Sixes, but is now pursuing a solo career. His debut release, Cold Medicine, is a crafty, broading songscape, followed by the LLC, which is a rock record with a healthy dose of alternative blues. That's the things that we like to hear. He's performed all over the U.S., Mexico, Canada, Japan, and Europe, just to name a few. A Even few. appearing at the Royal Albert Hall in London. Please help us give a very warm welcome to Doug Hinthor. Yeah. Uh, I, my man, you have been all over the world. I'm glad that you stopped right here in all Indiana. Thank well, you. I live here, so, you know, <laughs> I can't escape. There we go. <laughs> See, we like to welcome you into the all Indiana artist Thank family. You. Uh, you're so impressive. My goodness. When it comes to alternative blues, how do you explain that to people? What is it? Well, it's kind of a new term that I heard a buddy of mine talk about a while back. It's just a, it's just a new form of blues, I think. That's more, I think, a blend of rock mm. and and whatever else you want to pour into sure. it. Sure, because we love the blues, honey. Oh, yeah, yeah. We, we, we like a little, <laughs> we like a little, you know, look at my <laughs> knee moving already. It's the knee tap. <laughs> it's the knee tap, yes. You got a third <laughs> album coming out. Uh, tell us about that. That should be out hopefully by spring. I know I've been talking about it for the people that follow me like for a long time but yeah hopefully this spring it will be out i still don't have a title for it okay. so i'm up for any suggestions you guys come up with anything yeah. that's well, how we know it's going to be good maybe by the end of this we can come up with a little something I mean, yeah. we name everything we even name our cars it's a whole thing okay so See? we can probably help cool. you with that you know yeah. you've worked with some very big industry names we're talking about john hyatt and jason bonham you know how have they influenced your music well, John Hyatt really influenced me when I did my first solo record because I had just gotten done going down to Nashville to, to record background vocals for two records of his. Oh, okay. And, um, and I just think he's like, him and Kurt Vonnegut are two guys from Indiana that should have statues, you know, mm. to, in my opinion. Yeah. And, uh, Kurt almost does. He has that whole corner yeah, building right, right on yeah, Indiana yeah. Avenue. Yeah. Yeah. But, uh, <laughs> but yeah, so John really influenced me on my first solo record, Cold Medicine, and, and always does. He's just mm. a great songwriter. What influenced this song you're about to play for us today? This song is actually about, I watched a documentary about Howlin' Wolf, like the old yeah. blues guy. Mm -hmm. And um, it's out there, I don't even know what the documentary is called, but like they talked, the, his guitar player Hubert Sumlin talked about how they ran into uh, Wolf's mom at a barbershop down, down south, mm. like back in the day, and it was like a big, him and his mom did not get along. And mm. it was a really interesting, sad story, but it was a great, song idea so i kind of took it and, and he said at the end of the interview that uh, hubert said yeah wolf cried all the way back to memphis and i thought wow. well that's a great line so especially wow. for the blues let me ask you of course you're a musician but you're also a husband a dad yeah. uh your kids even traveling all over the world maybe he can adopt us so that way we can travel you all know over i want to get a stamp on my passport <laughs> that's what i'm yeah, saying i, <laughs> I mean yeah. when you see them kind of following in you know your footsteps of really getting their passions all throughout the world how does that make you feel and how does that impact your music it, it feels great and um, yeah, I think my kids have the same kind of wanderlust that I, you know, got mm -hmm. at a young age. Like wanting to travel. I think everybody should travel as much as they can. Mm -hmm. You know, I just think be more worldly wise and tolerant and all those things. So awesome, well, yeah. Doug. I'm, I'm anxious to see uh, how this music comes out uh, with this story behind it. So yes. go ahead and uh, take it away. Okay. All right. Here I go.
what the devil seen He bought it up and throw it down Said, boy, you better leave Yeah, the wolf cried on the way The wolf cried on the way The wolf cried on the way to Memphis